earlier he was he was um, very very severe very tough thing like that and uh, he was very scary but uh, in the in the second time in the early 90 he was very kind he was very kind and also he was he was older so you could feel that he wanted to transmit something he wanted to he knew that he was the last thing he wanted to yes so he wanted to really some to give that to somebody and and, and I think I, I was just at the right moment. Yes, um, and that also was a little bad interpretation also because um, because uh, in the ja in the Japanese way you, you cannot uh, you have to go through the hierarchy you cannot go straight to the master. master so and he was very and so he was very lonely he was uh, lonely and he was like um, you know because everybody was very too much respectful you'd be there and, there and nobody would really tell him the truth or talk to him really because they didn't want to, to talk to him quite casually so they would say us everything is good us us and that uh, nobody really you know, report or what's going uh, happening in those or anything so uh, and um, and uh, when I went there and I just talked to him just a normal person and uh, he would just, uh, you know, I was almost his son. He would just talk to me. Sometimes he would, uh, he was crazy because sometimes I was teaching. He, I was teaching, and he would get somebody to to okay. go with me. And he would come and we said, oh, and he would say, oh, Jack, come, bring the beer. <laughs> uh, yes, but I'm teaching now. But it doesn't matter. Dex, get somebody to teach and bring the beer. <laughs> and, and during the class, we would spend two hours. He would just sit there and we would just drink like an old friend. <laughs> and he would talk to me about, you know, about what, what happened when he was at the Wishiba Sensei or whatever. And, um, and, but that was very bad for the dojo because everybody else was teaching at the dojo. And, um, and we had been drinking with Kato Sensei. <laughs> so that was very nice. So people started to talk and say, oh, Jack is strange because he, you know, he doesn't go through the hierarchy. But uh, I didn't care because uh, I knew that uh, I was doing the right thing and I wanted to prove that uh, Freudian could do something good. And I just realized that just being with him, something happened. I don't know, it's, uh, it's um, uh, just the fact of talking to him and being with him that um, it, it gave me something that I would have never obtained in another way. I think I left in May 93, 1993. He just, because uh, she was sick and he, he was not teaching anymore. And uh, so it was really the last days. So I knew that it was time for me to and to, to see what I could do with Aikido now. You know, if, if Aikido were something, he had to be useful in a normal life. <coughs> How I could put that in practice in a, in a normal life. And also, since Kancho, sure that was not here, there was no reason for me to stay. Well, I think for me Aikido is a way to connect people between themselves. It's a way to connect to the world, connect to, pe to people between two people, to make, to make friends, to, you know, to, to make a connection. And in order to do that, you have to have a very strong base. If you, if you had a strong, uh, a strong base, so it's, it's the physical. I'm saying the physical should relate to the spiritual or something. Else. It's not something. I say. It's for the polyas. For the for the technique, you, you, if you understand the, the, the kamae, you have a good balance, and through the good balance, you you, you develop the, the, the proper muscle of the body. You get the center line, and when when you when, when you. You do a movement, you can do your entire body, and that allows you to, to connect with the other person when you do a technique. And if uh, and when that happens, you get the confidence. And when you get the confidence, you don't you you, you don't I'll say you, you can be 
relax and you can open to people and it's this openness that gives you uh, allow you to, 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 to connect with other people and that's that's why that's why I see which was to talk about harmonizing instead of because if you are a little bit afraid afraid or if you're tense it's very difficult to just like when you talk with somebody if you're a little tense it's very difficult to make contact but if you relax and you, 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 you smile and you, you feel uh, comfortable naturally people will, will relate to you open up and it's the same uh, in, in the technique and the same with life I think. and Aikido can help a lot of I think um, uh, Aikido is good because it gives you the discipline because uh, it's very easy to go to go the easy way okay you, People, it's easier to go down and to go up. Uh, so I see. For me, uh, of course, I'm very happy when uh, when I see um, the students get better and you can, you know, the posture getting better, training there. But when I can see somebody who is always always like that, and suddenly, you know, you come to smile and you can see in his in his face that he's become happy. So I think Aikido, it's a way, it's a, it's a way to become happier. And uh, I experience that every day at the dojo. And I think, uh, yes, thanks to Weshiba Sensei, to Shiva Sensei, it's a way, I think it's, a, it's just, for me, it's just a way to become happy. <laughs>
you're not angry. It hurts because you, but you hurt, but it hurts not because he slow you, because by yourself, your own ways, you fall. <laughs> and you can't be angry with him, <laughs> angry with you. <laughs> you angry with the floor. Yeah, and with the floor. And, the and you, you, you get in your head like that, but you smile. Yeah. And you get up and you want to mend. So this feeling, that's uh, what I felt that I said, I knew that that was like what I wanted to do and to do that. And, that, and now when I teach, I always remember that and I try to get this feeling. And, and I'm never satisfied unless I get this feeling. I'm not interested in uh, in the mechanic, in the, the body mechanic. But for me, there's no. For me, it's it's yes necessary for certain for beginners, but uh, I'm just interested in the feeling. And that's where it changed my life and changed my. I keep 